Hey everyone, welcome to day nine. Howdy everyone, this is Hey Johanna. Thank you so much for being here today for quarantine day nine. I'm so happy to have you here. Let's get into it. So day nine's prompt was bottle, and I don't know if this says more about me or more about New Zealand culture, but I immediately thought of bears on the beach in summer. The word bottle just makes me think of brown and green glass bottles, sand and music, and the warmth of the 10 p.m. sun. In fact, the memory of these kinds of summers was so vivid and so intense that I nearly cried. <laughs> I've been missing home a lot recently. I think it's just hard being away during this period of time because, you know, everyone is stuck inside. I can't really see any friends. I'm thousands of kilometers away from my family and the cabin fever is real. Anyway, for those of you that don't know, New Zealand makes some very, very nice craft beers. Tui is not one of those beers. It's one of the cheapest pissed beers that we proudly brew, the quintessential beer of the Bogans and the Beach Bums. The bottles also have trivia questions on the inside of the caps and like 10 years ago, the company had billboards all over the country. The Year Right Tui campaign was so iconic in the tackiest but most Kiwi way. Anyway, it's a very iconic Kiwi beer for multiple reasons that I think half of the country can't really explain because I don't think I know a single person who will drink Tui beer if there is another option, but that also might be my Wellingtonian coming out. Tui is also a very common, very beautiful bird we have in New Zealand, so I thought drawing some Tui beer bottles along with a Tui bird and some kofi flowers in the background would be a really good representation of my thoughts when I heard the word bottle. And this piece came out looking like an advertisement for a New Zealand summer. It is so Kiwiana. The only thing missing is a freaking pavlova, so I'm stoked because it represents my thoughts very well. Anyway, this is the closest that I'm going to be able to get to New Zealand for a wee while because, you know, COVID-19. But it makes me happy to look at this drawing and it makes me feel so proud to share this tiny slice of culture with you all as well. So here is day nine completed with the prompt bottle. I love this piece so much. It screams summer to me and it's making me so, so impatient for summer this year. Though I think that a Swedish summer will be slightly different than what I'm used to. Kia ora everyone, have a wonderful evening and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.